guys, I thought I'd show you what little craft activity we're going to do today. I haven't tested it. It could be a total fail, but it could be lots of fun. So we've got a whole bunch of ear cartons. Show us your ear cartons. Have you got some there too? Yep. And I've also got some watercolour paint. And I'm going to set up three different stations with three different colours. I've cut the ripped the egg cartons, cut some, but I've decided I'm just going to rip them um, into little um, kind of rounded shapes and then we're going to paint them. So I'm just going to give the kids one colour at a time and then we'll switch Harvey's it up. with a golden colour. And what did you just learn about the water and the paint, Harvey? Uh, it makes it more of the paint. Yeah. Like so colors. yeah, I've just, I've been adding quite a bit of water to make it go further. This is what we made. Um, I just let the colour, like Piper mixed up all the purple herself and things. Once she got to brown, I took it away. And they got about a bit bored after about 20 minutes of painting. So this is it here, which is super exciting. I'm going to do a close up. We had a lot of fun making this. And the colours worked out really well. It was a bit of a fluke. And yeah, the kids had fun, I had fun. And now we have something really cute to put on the wall in their little activity note. Sorry, the lighting isn't great, but let me show you what I did. I basically just got thread, cotton thread, and tied um, a knot in the bottom, added the first one. I used a needle, a large needle. Then I tied another kind of loop, added the next one, and just kept doing that. They all kind of have different distances between them. Some were big, some were little, and it doesn't really matter because it's kind of ended up this really cool organic kind of style wall hanging. Oh, and then I just tied them all at the top to the dowel. Um, and then I also tied a piece of cotton thread across the top as the hanger. Easy peasy.